just as a parent first. People recognize Stuart and Jessica nationally for what they do and certainly for who they are. But for us, when Jess came here with Parker, she was a mom. In the beginning, it was very uncertain. Parker really struggled with communication and he would get aggressive, like headbanging behavior. It was hard to hear that there was something wrong with your child. When we went to the pediatrician, she gave us a diagnosis of, of autism and, and she says your son's on the spectrum and getting that diagnosis was, was, was a shock. We were scared. This isn't necessarily a bad thing, but it's something that obviously changed our lives. Stuart Friesen wins. My husband, Stuart Friesen, is a professional race car driver. He runs a Dirt Modified as well as the Craftsman Truck Series. I do get to race from time to time. And then with the truck team, I handle the travel and the accommodations and the rental cars and the payroll and the daily um, who needs what. It got pretty real really quick when, when we got that diagnosis. Our goals went from racing and doing everything we can for our race teams to, you know, okay, how do we get Parker the help he needs? We did a lot of research about ABA therapy, applied behavioral analysis, and we got in touch with Crossroads Center for Children. And when Parker was almost two, we were able to start uh, ABA therapy in home with Crossroads, and it was life changing. Crossroads started in 98 as a school for children with autism specifically. Now we serve children with many developmental disabilities. Hi, bud. How was your day? Looking back on it now, you know, he's approaching his eighth, eighth birthday. He's doing awesome. He's in second grade, and he just, he just loves school and, and loves life. He's full of energy. I hope all of you are watching this. What those teachers in that school has done for Parker and, and our lives, you know, we'll never be able to repay that. Now we're able to give back in every little bit that we possibly can to educate people and to, to help centers like Crossroads to be able to help families like they helped us. So we've created AIM Autism to aim our funds and aim our fundraising efforts directly to children's centers that need it. And we do two a year right now with the autism barbecue and the golf tournament that we've had the last two years. This year we did our annual autism awareness chicken barbecue at Fonda Speedway, a local dirt track that I grew up at in upstate New York. And we were able to raise almost $30,000 this year. Jess's fundraising for us has been twofold. One, certainly just raising the funds has been important to us. But more importantly, she's opened doors and given us opportunities that we wouldn't have had. So she's introduced us to NASCAR truck series and then also dirt tracks. And we have so many more uh, supporters and followers and people just know what we do. To pull these fundraisers off, you know, you don't sit back and look at it. You just keep going and keep moving forward and what's gonna happen next and how are we gonna raise more money? How are we gonna help other families? This is an award that we made for Jessica for all the work that she did for us. This is Jessica Friesen Life Changer Award. We think we're changing lives here every day. I know that we are. Our staff are changing lives every day. But we couldn't do that without people like Jess supporting us and helping to spread the word and get our name out there. We're a small little school in upstate New York. We're not going to get our name out nationally if it's not for people like Jess. She inspires me every day just to, to be a better person, to be a, a better racer, to be a better father. I tell her this daily, but she's a, she's a superhero. She's a rock star. She's, she's all of that, you know, balled up into one.